Hello, welcome to a priori story timeless. Here with a little hedgehog and a beaver. There you go. <laughs> Are you guys ready for story time? <coughs> this one's for Tommy. I love you. This is uh, called The Origin of Constellation Gichiojik. Um, this is uh, uh, told by Alec Paul um, from Th Timagami um, uh, and recorded by Frank Speck. <coughs> so we know what a fisher cat is, a fisher, like a, like a weasel type uh, weasel family uh, creature. The fisher was living somewhere in this world. Nobody knows where. Now, in those times they had no summer, it was winter. Winter all the time. They knew that summer existed somewhere, but it never came to them, although they wanted it very much. And once upon a time, a man captured some little birds, which are called Nibenise, summer birds or guardian birds. He tied them in bundles and kept them with him all the time. That was the reason why it was continually winter. For so long as he held these birds, they could not bring summer to the North Country. The people pondered very much how to go about freeing these birds from the creature who kept them. At last, somebody discovered where this creature lived and they decided that someone would go and try and free the summer birds. The freshwater herring lived in the same wigwam as the man who kept the summer birds. The fisher, <coughs> Gichiojig, decided to go and free the birds so that summer would come. He traveled a long while and reached the wigwam where the captor and the herring lived. When he went in, he found the herring alone. He captured the herring and put some pitch on his mouth so that he couldn't cry out. Then Fisher took the bundles of birds and tried to break the bindings so that he could free them. Using his teeth, at last he tore open the bundles and the summer birds flew free into the air. Then the pitch broke from the herring's mouth and he cried out, Fisher breaks the bundle, the summer birds. Fisher breaks the bundles with his teeth, the summer birds. Two or three times he cried out until their captor heard him. Then he came up running, but when he arrived, the fisher and summer birds were far away. The fisher ran <coughs> very fast to save himself. His pursuer had a bow and arrow with which he was going to kill him. But the fisher sprang into the sky and climbed way up with the hunter following behind him still trying to shoot him with his bow and arrow all he succeeded in shooting however was his tail which is broken where it was wounded <coughs> and this is the story of the constellation Gichiojik something you may know as the Big Dipper, the small star, Alcor is the wound. They've never got the fissure. Thank you for joining us. Okay, ready? Hello, running hug. Thank you.